How you guys doing? Uh, welcome to my channel. Guys, what I want to talk about today is the you against you concept. Uh, that's what I want to talk about today. I was talking to my friend a couple days ago and I was saying nothing is really hard. Nothing is. God has programmed us. If you put the human mind to it, you can accomplish it. Now other people, people learn at different rates and some, some people take longer to achieve a certain or particular goal. But it's all you against you. We can, we can adapt to our atmosphere and surroundings and we can legitimately, legitimately achieve a goal. It doesn't matter how hard it is and we put all that we have into it. We're shaped, we're created. God created us for us, uh, he created us to achieve. No matter the adversity or the circumstances, he created us to achieve, to, to push through. So that's why I wanna bring up the you against you concept. It's not your opponents. It's not, you know, competition is, is natural and competition is healthy, but at the end of the day, it's really you against you. It's not, it's not that you're going against, hey, this person is, is an executive. Hey, I'm trying to outdo him. I'm trying to be a CEO of a company. Oh, this person plays sports better than me. I'm trying to outdo him. He's my goal is out. No, no, no. Although that is healthy, as far as the motivation aspect, it's really you against you. How are you going to defeat yourself? How, how are you going to defeat that negative self-talk? How are you going to get to the next level? Because that's, what, that's all it really is. It's you, let's say, you're trying to move on. You're trying to improve. How do you improve from one stage in your life to another stage? Obviously, you have to be a better, you have to be a better you. So now it's 2015. How are you gonna improve in 2016? You're the same person. You have the same physical shape. You have the same sort of, you have the same mind, but how are you going to improve? You're gonna change your paradigm of thinking. You're gonna fight the old you to create a new you. Anything that's old that you wanna any like a bad habit or anything that are bad cycle of events that you want to uh, brush out of your life you have to become a new you to defeat the old you and the bible says as a man thinketh, so is he so you're gonna have to change your paradigm of thinking folks and changing your paradigm of thinking is not comparing yourself to somebody else changing your paradigm of thinking is comparing yourself to yourself that and that is what makes you, you grade yourself, you, re, you report on yourself so that you can improve. For example, if you ran three miles, if you've been running three miles for the past year, how do you, you, you take a self introspection, you inspect yourself, and then you say, hey, you know what? I've been running three miles. Let me see if I can run four miles or five miles. That's how you improve. I'm not in competition with the next guy. I'm in competition with myself. God made us all unique, all unique. So it makes no sense to be in competition with somebody. Be yourself, thrive inside yourself and be different. But at the end of the day, guys, it's not you against other opponent. At the end of the day, throughout your entire life, it's gonna be you versus you. And always remember that. And my name is Marquis uh, Franks, Christian Life Coach. You guys have a great day out there.